It's exciting for me to be here at Millsaps. Uh, first of all, um, I, I came here after 17 seasons of coaching women's golf at uh, McNeese State in Lake Charles, Louisiana. Uh, this is the biggest team I've been a part of since I've been here at Millsaps. I'm excited. Um, all of us, uh, we're, we're pretty competitive and because of that we're, we're a strong team and we can compete well. Yeah, I, I, I think coaching in general I think is a lot about building relationships. Uh, your, your players uh, might forget some of the things that you teach them about golf, uh, but they'll never forget how you treated them. Uh, so having a good relationship, an open, honest relationship with your players, uh, they have to know that you're on their side, you got their back. Uh, I think that's really important and that, that uh, you only want the best for them. Overall, the fall was probably one of the strongest uh, seasons I've been a part of here at Millsaps. We won a, a match play event against Centenary in Shreveport, which was very exciting. And we also had some strong finishes um, in other tournaments as well. Here, here in the spring, now that I've had a, a, a semester with them, I've got to know them a little bit. I've got to, to learn a little bit about their strengths as players, their weaknesses, the things that they have to get better at. I think the spring is going to be a little bit different than the fall. Uh, we, we have added a fourth course to uh, our practice uh, routine. Uh, we'll now be playing at the Refuge on Mondays. Uh, we're, we're also going to start with workouts this spring. Uh, they'll be working out uh, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 6 a.m. in the morning. Working on, on flexibility, working on endurance, working on getting a little bit stronger uh, so that when we get to the conference tournament in April, uh, and we have to play four consecutive days. Uh, when, we, when you count the practice round that you play, and then you're gonna have three consecutive days of, of uh, tournament rounds, uh, it, it, it does require some, some stamina and some strength to, to get through that. So uh, we're, we're hoping that those things, adding those things into the mix this spring uh, is going to, uh, going to help us. I'm honestly looking forward to going back to the SAA Championship, which we played at last, last year. We didn't do so well, but I feel like since a couple of us know the course, we can teach it to the new members of the team and help guide them along the way so we can yeah. succeed well. I, I really don't have any favorites as far as that is concerned. Uh, for me personally, uh, our opening tournament at Mobile, uh, by, uh, University of Mobile, uh, I'm looking forward to that just simply because uh, great golf course, uh, the crossings at Magnolia Grove, uh, we're, and, and, and the competition, we're stepping up a little bit. Uh, and uh, also on the women's side, we're, we're going to play in William Carey's tournament, which is another NAI event. Uh, Gulf Shores, Alabama, with the same type of scenario, uh, with a mixture of Division II, NAIA, Division III schools. Uh, so uh, that'll be a good challenge for the for the girls to, to step into. Uh, we play at Deerfield Country Club on Thursdays. Uh, it Deerfield is a good golf course for us to play as well for tournament preparation. Uh, the the greens are quick. Uh, they're really fast, uh, they're firm, uh, the, golf, the golf course is basically tree-lined, so you've got to control your golf ball. Uh, they, have, uh, they do have a decent uh, uh, short game practice area, uh, and so that'll give us one day where we can start working. We spend a little bit more time on our, on our short game uh, skills. Uh, but, uh, and then on Fridays we play at Live Oaks, um, their, their greens are small, uh, it's tree-lined, uh, and uh, the greens are very quick. So I, I think that the, the idea of playing at four different facilities, with, uh, that, that challenges each, every part of your game, uh, is going to help us be better prepared. And one thing that I might mention uh, that's coming up for us in the spring as well, is uh, an opportunity one day a month to play at Annandale Country Club. Uh, so we, we've kind of added that into the mix now. 
Uh, that'll, that'll give us probably four rounds at Annandale for the spring. Uh, and any, any time that you can get your players on top quality golf courses like, like Annandale, uh, it, it can only help you.